the player has agreement with no club yet, so everything is in discussion, everything will take time, so Bellingham is not deciding now, this week, next week. Hey guys, welcome back on the channel, Fabrizio Romano here as always to keep you posted on the transfer market and today guys, time to answer many of your questions one of the best players around the world, not just talents, but we can say one of the best players at all and this Jude Bellingham, he's doing fantastic with Borussia Dortmund, fantastic with the English national team and what's next? We have many questions, many rumors, so let's jump into it together. Guys, if you're following the channel, you know that a few weeks ago I made a video about Jude Bellingham and I told you, my sources are telling me that this is gonna be the new kind of Erling Haaland race with many clubs involved. Today, I can tell you, get ready because we're gonna have crazy, crazy months of rumors around Jude Bellingham. But before entering into the clubs, guys, it's important to uh, understand one point. Borussia Dortmund are not negotiating with any club as of today, there are no talks ongoing, Borussia Dortmund will make a final price after the World Cup because there is no clause into the contract of Jude Bellingham, no official clause included, and so they can make the price. They know, of course, that when many top clubs are jumping on the player, it's normal to understand that he's gonna leave next summer, but Borussia Dortmund will discuss about it after the World Cup because the performances of Jude Bellingham at the World Cup could influence the price tag. So this is a really important bullet point of this Jude Bellingham story. And then, as I mentioned, many, many rumors. Get ready, guys, because some of these rumors, as always, are true. Some of these rumors will not be true. It's part of the game, but what is real, what is true, is that all the top European clubs, the top European giants, will be there. Some of them have already started contacts, some of them are waiting to enter into the race, but let's mention some clubs. Liverpool. Liverpool will be there for Jude Bellingham. They wanted Chouameni uh, earlier during this year, end of May, beginning of June. It was impossible to change his mind as he wanted Real Madrid. And so for uh, Liverpool, the priority next summer is to sign a new uh, midfielder, a new important midfielder, and they saved money uh, during the summer uh, because they signed Artur Melo on loan. And so Jude Bellingham will be a priority. Manchester City will be there. Man City will go for a midfielder next summer, and Jude Bellingham is highly rated of course. Manchester United uh, are always thinking of Jude Bellingham. They know they are not in an easy position with many clubs on him, but May United will try also to explore this possibility. And then Real Madrid, not just English clubs. Real Madrid uh, sold Casemiro to Manchester United at the end of August, and next summer could be the case to go for a midfielder, even if they signed Chouameni. They have Camavinga, fantastic players for the future, but they have also players like Modric, Kroos, they are doing fantastic, but with short contracts. So this is why Bellingham is also in Real Madrid list and everything is absolutely open. The player has agreement with no club yet, so everything is in discussion, everything will take time, so Bellingham is not deciding now, this week, next week. All these clubs will be there. Also, other clubs will be there because we know how strong Chelsea are on a financial point of view. And so Chelsea are thinking of a new midfielder for next summer. They wanted Frankie de Jong this summer. Next summer, there is a situation of Kanté and Jorginho contracts. So they can go for a midfielder and Jude Bellingham is attracting interest also from Chelsea. So there will be many clubs in the race and we have to follow step by step how they will proceed in negotiations with Borussia Dortmund. For sure Borussia Dortmund will try to do again early business, not to arrive like at the end of August, at the end of July for Bellingham, to try to discuss around April, May, June for their jewel, but get ready because rumors will be there every single day and this Bellingham story will live off step by step stories. And so guys, let me know your thoughts on Jude Bellingham. How much do you think he's worth and where do you see his future, his future next club? I wait for your opinion, guys. Here as always, like this video, turn on the notification bell, subscribe to the channel. See you soon with Fabrizio. Ciao.